Hi there, welcome back. Today, I will give you tips on what to do when your server gets raided. The first step is, don't panic and start kicking or banning members. That's not going to help you. Just go to your server settings. Scroll down and click invites. Here, all you have to do is click pause invites. This is going to pause all the invites that were created in your server. And the best part is, if someone creates a new invite, it will also get caused until you enable invites again. Don't you think that's the coolest feature? Another way to reduce the impact of the raiders is to go to the channel settings and ensure that all permissions are checked. In everyone role, please make sure to disable view channel so unverified members cannot see the channels that you don't them to see. It could be chat channels or any channel that requires verification. As for verified role, you can enable view channel perm. But make sure they don't have any dangerous perms. When I say dangerous perms, I mean mentioning everyone for here roles and even perms to delete messages. Now, go to server settings and then click roles. Click verify role. This role is normally assigned once a new member verifies, so please make sure that you did not give any dangerous perms. You have to be very careful with this one. Please take your time and check if there are no dangerous perms that could cause a huge loss to your server. After confirming that step, I can recommend a helpful bot that will effectively prevent any potential raids on your server. Invite Wick Bot. This bot is one of my favorite bot for moderation. It will 100% keep your server safe. I'll guide you on how to invite this bot. Just go to your server settings, then click App Directory. This is Discord's new feature, you can use this to invite bot you want. Right now we will invite Wickbot. Since I already have this bot in my server, I will simply click out. Make sure that the bot has admin perm. Once that's done, just go to Wickbot's dashboard. Now select the server you want. Click logging here I forgot to tell you that, you need to create two log channels, the first one is to record normal log and the second is for for moderation related logs. The purpose is to maintain a systematic approach to everything. Once that's done, just scroll down and click the join gate feature. It's one of the best features and I absolutely love it. Here, you can basically control who can join your Discord server. And within this feature, you will find many features that you can use if you want. Now, the feature that I want to show you is account age. In this feature, if you select a particular account age, for example, 10 days, Wickbot will basically not allow members whose accounts are below 10 days old. This way, you can keep the raiders away from your server. Here, I want to give you a tip to disable, make Wick show the minimum age required when DM, so raiders would never know the minimum age requirement in your server. Don't you think these features are really cool? You should try them out. By the way, I have already made a detailed video on Wickbot. You can use its other features too to keep your server safe. The link of this video will be in my description. In this video, I have shown how to set up anti-raid verification and I am sure no raiders can bypass that. Anyway, if you are looking for server decorations and layouts, just join my server. We have a wide variety of decors and layouts available, so you can find any decor and layout you desire. And if we don't have the one you want, we will get it for you. If you need help with setting up bots and getting server design ideas, we will gladly assist you. All you have to do is just hop in. So that's it for today. I hope this video has been super helpful to you. I know all the tips I gave were just basic, but sometimes we overlook those small things, and great losses can happen. So, I hope you use these tips to keep your server safe. If you use anything else for raid protection, let me know in the comments.